So I think Bungie made a mistake in disabling the Telesto. The Telesto wasn't a problem. I believe it's the Ashes to Assets perk or mod which is the real issue. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like truly helps out and subscribe if you want to see more Destiny 2. Okay, so over the past week or so, a glitch was discovered which allowed the user of said glitch to get their super almost instantly via combining the Ashes to Assets mods which grants super energy on grenade kills with while throwing their grenades at Telesto projectiles which were stuck on the floor or wall or wherever. Yes, if you lined up a bunch of Telesto shots and made sure they were separated by a small margin then threw your grenade at them, you could literally get your whole super back in about 5 seconds. It's crazy. The Telesto in game has now been disabled by Bungie. But people, the glitch is still here. The glitch still works. The glitch is still as easy as ever. Now credit to Cheese Forever as I believe he was the first to post this. His channel can be found linked to within the video description. Now the new way to do this is to throw those grenades at sticky grenades fired from any grenade launcher available in the game. Yes, even the mountaintop, the prospector, just about every other grenade launcher that fires stickies that attach to walls or the floor. Now considering the glitches we have seen such do in the past, like the Menagerie encounter, the gauntlet where you would stand just in front of the line and shoot your Telesto or Prospector or any other weapon across the line which fired projectiles or sticky grenades, they would somehow count as guardians crossing the line. Now it's quite clear from here that these weapons and their projectiles are somehow classed as guardians. Now I don't know what kind of voodoo that is, but it's true. So it seems Bungie have indeed disabled the wrong thing. They should have disabled the mod of Ashes to Assets, not the individual weapons. Well actually, thinking about it, Bungie, if you want to go ahead and disable the mountaintop, I'll be cool with that. I mean, playing Iron Banner this past week, you'd think there was a hidden quest where you had to get a thousand kills with a mountaintop and recluse while wearing the one-eyed gimp mask. So yeah, Bungie, nerf the effing lot. I mean, it seems as though that the actual choice they made in the first place was the wrong one and really the problem is and the problem comes from the Ashes to Assets mod available on many armors in the game. But yeah guys, the glitch is still here, the glitch still works and well, it's still kind of game breaking. Now thanks to my pal Dark Arm Games for recording me this footage of this glitch in action using the mountain top. I just asked him to record me a couple of minutes just demonstrating how you can get super energy via throwing your grenades at sticky mountaintop grenades stuck to walls or whatever. It's just ridiculous people. But on that note, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see daily Destiny videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.